they just were more hesitant to like approach him. So just the, um, the looks, you know, in the cafeteria. Ethan Tevis was born with Soto syndrome, a rare genetic disorder characterized by excessive physical growth for the first year of his life. It affects his appearance, movement, behavior, and his speech. I knew him when he was in his mom's stomach. Um, my connection, we have no blood relation, but I would consider him my cousin. I found out later on that people were giving him a hard time. And felt kind of sad because he doesn't deserve that. Even the simplest tasks are hard for Ethan. So, to help him cope with his disability, Ethan attends special sessions after school to practice his motor skills. He goes to these extra programs to be able to speak and be able to have a conversation with his classmates so that he can understand what they're saying. It's because a lot of people don't understand how to help him or how to act, interact with them. Students didn't know how to really approach him. Um, kind of at the beginning of the school year, so I think some Students weren't very used to him. Since it was Disability Month, Ethan's mother, Miss Jennifer Tevis, asked Colton Guzman to make a video for Ethan, explaining what he normally goes through on his daily life to show to his classmates. I give um, Colton a lot of footage, you know, pictures from when he was a baby and a lot of videos. He really compressed it into a nice video that was a learning video as well. He was born with Soto syndrome, which affects his development, so it takes him a long time to do what you can do. After watching the video, Ethan's classmates better understood what Ethan goes through, and they started getting to know him. His teacher, Miss Shannon Kaku, could see Ethan's classmates had a change on their perspective on him. Because they knew how to communicate with him, and that they were more aware of him. We were classmates in the beginning, and then by the end, we were just, we were just a big third grade family. Kids are really friendly, and they're all coming towards him. You know, and even when I visited the school as well, you know, everyone was... There was, no, there was no hesitancy anymore. They were all like, like he was like everybody else. They're able to see a side of Ethan that they can't see at school. After watching the video, the kids learned just how important it is to understand others before judging them. They knew that it was, you know, very challenging to be someone with special needs. If you just get to know someone on your own, it's a better connection, it's a deeper friendship, it's a stronger relationship. And I think that's important in life. This is Taika Jihara from Chief Kamakahele Middle School for Hikino.